Hey there, we are going to make a castle. So you're going to start making your castle. You want, whoops, you want about midway on your paper. That for part of your castle. And then this for part of your castle. My castle's going to kind of float though. It's sort of a magical castle. Yours doesn't have to. It can go all the way to the ground. That's up to you. Alright, I'm going to erase my overlapping line. I may or may not be putting a line there. Okay, so I want to section off my castle into one, two, three areas. This area, I want to put a door. And I want it to be big. And I want it to have little stones going all the way around my door. Kind of skinny decorative ones. Alright, then on my door I want bars on my door. Two big bars that say we mean business and I want to shade those in. And then I want to draw a line down the middle to show my two doors. They're wooden doors, so I kind of want to wood grain. And I want to color them brown. Alright, now I need to make some bricks. So, um, you know what, actually, I want to make the, put a little topper on your castle. Okay. And castles always have kind of like little cutouts little cutouts going all the way over. In fact, the more not perfect they are, the awesomer it looks. Alright, then I'm going to take my eraser and I'm going to erase just the line up top so that it looks more castle-y. Now that I have my castle-y look, I'm going to draw my turrets. Okay, so this top one is going to be kind of a small turret, otherwise you're not going to see the flag on the top. And then I want a triangle and a little flag. Alright, let me show you. Each side is the same. You want a turret, so kind of like a cylinder look. You want a triangle on that cylinder, and then you want a little flag. It's like a little sideways triangle. So again, you want to draw like a cylinder on your cylinder. You want a triangle. On your triangle, you want a little flag waving in the wind. I kind of want to put a little dot on the top of my flag. Alright, so I need some windows in my turrets. Here's a window. Just make kind of like a rainbow with a little shelf. Here's a rainbow with a little shelf. A rainbow with a little shelf. Alright, last but not least, I need some stones in this. So I'm going to draw some lines. Just straight across lines. Skip over the door. Skip over the door. 
skip over the door, skip over the door, skip over the door, and then I'm just going to continue these lines. Alright, now I'm going to make my bricks. So I'm going to make just some lines, some random lines, going all the way over. Okay, now I don't want the lines to line up like the wood grain, I want it to look more like stone. So I'm not going to have it line up. I want it totally mismatched. your imagination. Bricks are never perfectly placed. But I'm going to have Or actually they could be stones. It could be a stone castle. So there's my castle. I'm going to take my black crayon or black thin magic marker if I have one. And I am going to go over all these castle -y lines. Remember, it doesn't matter which lines you go over first.
go, boys and girls. Abracadabra. And there we go, boys and girls. There's some color on our castle. Now, if you want to add an extra detail to the turrets, you just put crisscrossy lines on them. Um, and you can color the background. Uh, make your castle however you wish. Thank you, boys and girls, for listening.